Hey everyone, it's Sister Liz here, and I want to welcome you to the first ever Sister Liz Investigates. Um, it's 200 years since Elizabeth Seton came here to the Valley in Emmitsburg, and I'm here to find out what the sisters of my house think about it being the bicentennial year of Elizabeth Seton. So come with me, and we're going to start here at the house and then go over to the school. Come on. St. Elizabeth Ann Seton is significant because she is a model for people like us. She was a young girl, a daughter, a woman who fell in love, married, had five beautiful children that she loved dearly. She loved the Eucharist. And that's one of the inheritances that we have today, her love of God in word and sacrament. And with that strength, we too can follow God's call and respond and grow in personal holiness, living out our baptism the way she did. I work at Mother Seton School as a resource teacher. I like to say I take the kids that didn't get it and help them to get it. Because we can help children to find the thing that they can do the best and to excel in that thing and to have confidence that they can do something and do it very well. to really have everyone who comes in touch with Mother Seton to tap into her spiritual energy and especially the way she was able to connect and relate to people. It's just um, a, a great uh, opportunity for me to grow in my own faith and to uh, not only admire but imitate a great woman. She was centered, her heart was focused, and inspired other people, and continues to inspire people. And really because of that, we have Catholic education, we have formation, we have health care, and all the groups of Sisters of Charity, together with the Daughters of Charity, serve God in the church in just such a wonderful way. All right, that's it, everybody. Thanks for watching. See you next time.